A lot of you are wondering right now, is the crypto market crashing? Is it going to continue to crash? Because we have seen the crypto market take a massive move to the downside. And in this video, I'm going to be explaining to you exactly why this is happening and where we are headed. But things are getting absolutely crazy. But let me show you guys my new condo that I got here in Miami, which is absolutely gorgeous. Not furnished fully, being that I just moved in, but you can see the beautiful ocean view. You can see the boats, you can see Miami Beach, just an amazing thing. But guys, we must be completely cognizant of what is happening in the crypto market because we have President Biden. He is wanting to sign an executive order at any second about crypto regulation. And in this video, we are going to be diving into exactly what this means. Should you be freaking out? Should you be panicking? All of the above, we're gonna be talking about in this video. And there's a bunch of very important, just breaking information, news articles that we must discuss as well. In addition to looking at technical analysis to see where your Dogecoin, your Shiba Inu, your cryptos are headed. So right now here I'm at the computer, we're gonna be taking a dive into seeing what's happening because things are getting crazy. But before we do, make sure you smash up the like button guys if you love cryptocurrencies and make sure you subscribe with notifications on so you do not miss these time sensitive videos where we call out huge plays for free way before they happen so you know what is happening at all times. And if you want to get access to the most profitable crypto trading community in the world and to get early access into new cryptocurrencies that are doing fair launches where you can make 100x to 200x gains in a crazy short amount of time, go ahead and join the Patreon where we can go over your current portfolio. You can speak to me on the phone. We have a whole bunch of services over there to make you money. Join the free Telegram and the Discords below as well. And follow all the socials. Check out all the links in my video description. We have a crypto trading course, a whole bunch of stuff over there and in my video description. Go ahead, check it out. But without further ado, let's go ahead and dive straight into this content. The reason why you guys are here. So here we have it, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go ahead and just take a look at Bitcoin. As we know, Bitcoin is the market. It is the lifeline of the whole crypto ecosystem. And if we take some of these indicators off and go ahead and zoom out and see what's happening in the charts, it is bearish, guys. We are certainly bearish. As the last couple of days, we were looking very bullish. We were continuing to go up and up and up. And then we were barely getting any drops. And now we are starting to get some bearish momentum. We are starting to get some drops because we are starting to see a lot of fear in the market, guys. Look at this. The crypto fear and greed index is at a 30 and it is climbing in the negative, fearful direction. And we know that when there is a lot of fear and there's people panicking, people do not want to buy. No, most people do not want to buy because they are panicking. They're fearful of crazy events in the future that are appearing as ominous. And the reason for this is because Biden is going to be issuing an executive order about crypto oversight and crypto regulation. And basically what this means, and to give you complete honesty and transparency of why you should not be afraid, why this is not the end of the world, Biden is signing an executive order not to regulate cryptocurrencies, but for people to look into it so that a whole bunch of agencies out there can have an opinion on cryptocurrencies, especially CBDCs, the central bank digital currencies, take a look at those, see what relevance they have into the current government, the United States, taxes, and everything else. So it's really nothing major. They're literally just doing an executive order to look into cryptocurrencies to see what part cryptocurrencies and blockchain can play into the government, the economy, the treasury, and so forth. So nothing crazy, guys. Just the name of it sounds terrible. Sounds ominous. Sounds like something terrible is about to happen. That cryptos are going to be down forever. No, it's literally nothing. So nothing to be fearful about. And in addition to this, we have the Russian-Ukraine invasion FUD. That's also pushing prices down because Ukraine actually has one of the largest holdings of cryptocurrencies in the entire world. Can you believe that? And just the other day, they legalized Bitcoin literally two days ago. Just crazy stuff happening. So the fear is coming from this executive order. That's why we're seeing a sell-off. We're seeing inflation. We are seeing the Russian invasion. And that is stalling the market, guys. That's why we are seeing a dip. But there's no reason to panic. There's no reason to be selling off everything. No. But we are going to be diving in right now to exactly where I think the market is headed because it is very, very interesting where we could potentially head. I'm going to keep it completely real with you. And if you guys love cryptocurrencies, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. But let's go ahead and dive straight into the content. But before we do, one more quick thing, guys. 
If you want to be able to trade cryptocurrencies tax-free, go ahead and create an iTrust Capital account. You can literally trade a whole bunch of cryptos over here. You can literally trade a whole bunch of cryptocurrencies under this tax umbrella where you're not going to be paying capital gains. You're not going to be paying crazy taxes and they use Coinbase holdings. Highly recommend it, especially if you plan on making a lot of money in cryptocurrencies or holding cryptocurrencies for the next several years. Trade a lot of your cryptocurrencies in here so that you are saving so much. They have so many different cryptocurrencies. I highly recommend it. And when you fund an account, they will send you free $100 in Bitcoin. But guys, look at this. Let's take a look at the market. So the market is not terrible the last 24 hours some are da up down one percent two percent three percent four percent the last seven days we're seeing three percent to four percent um, we even have xrp that's actually up today and up three percent the last seven days so most cryptocurrencies are red and they're not crashing significantly no it's not crazy but even look at this guys warren buffett finally the man who has hated Bitcoin from the start now invests $1 billion into a Bitcoin-friendly bank and dumps Visa and MasterCard stocks for these crypto opportunities. This is a huge sign, guys. This is like the most successful, one of the wealthiest men in the entire world, and he is getting involved in two cryptocurrencies, one who has hated cryptocurrencies for so long, and now he's getting involved. That is a huge positive sign. That's a huge positive sign that things are about to take off. Yes, in the long term, the short term right now, yes, things are a little volatile, but in the long term, the next year, the next several years is where real money is going to be made in cryptocurrencies. But I have some even better information, guys. Go ahead and check this out. So here we have the chart. And honestly, what I think is going to happen, what is most likely going to happen is that we may continue this downtrend, guys. We may see a bigger move. And I told you guys literally a couple of days ago, make sure you watch my videos. I gave you some very important information. I said, guys, we are starting to flip bearish and it started to happen very, very quickly because of news and FUD out there. And that can change things from bullish to bearish very, very quickly. And when things start to change, we must be very careful to how we play this market. If you wanna make the most of it, that's why you join the Patreon, so I tell you exactly what to do, when to do, and how to do it. So go ahead and check out the Patreon. The link is in my video description. But guys, to tell you what is most likely going to happen is I think that we are most likely going to head lower, potentially going to test this level of support, which is gonna be bringing us to about 36 to $37,000. So in all honesty, we could see a correction of about 10%, guys. We could see a 10% move to the downside. But I also would not be surprised and would love to certainly see this if we were to get somewhat of a bounce in this area. That's why if I zoom into the five minute time frame, we are still trading sideways. Ever since we have dropped, we are just trading sideways. And it's looking like there is going to be a move to the downside in all honesty. But it would not surprise me if we ended up getting a bounce after such a significant drop and a significant drop so quickly. So that's honestly what I think is going to be happening in the crypto market that we might see and continue to see some more downside action, but it is not the end of the world. It's just providing us incredible buying opportunities where we can buy some of these dips before we really head up because there's a lot of very bullish things happening behind the scenes for cryptos, a lot of bullish things happening all around the world for cryptocurrencies that is going to push crypto cryptos to the moon in my opinion and i think that is going to be happening soon but remember nothing of this video is financial advice it's just my own opinion and yes i am showing you the bitcoin chart what you're you're going to be asking okay well, what about dogecoin what about shiba Inu? it's the same exact thing this chart and what i think is going to be happening when whether we going whether we are going to be going up or down is completely completely consistent with every single cryptocurrency most of which that we hold so guys that's just going to be it for today's video the market is shaky, yes, and that's just the short term. It's not the long term. The market is shaky. There's just a lot of FUD out there. And we know when there's FUD, there's people panicking, there's fear. It causes drops, but we do know that big drops cause big bounces in the market. We will see big bounces because of big crashes and big drops. And get ready because there may be some drops, but there's going to be some massive pumps this year, in my opinion. And let me know if you agree with that in the comments below. And everything is going to be okay. We're going to be completely fine. Keep holding on with diamond hands as I do every single day. And do not fear this whale manipulation and do not fear these whale games. It is going to be fine.